Hello everyone, Commander Kingfish here, and I am uh, back in uh, Space Engineers. Well, if you remember last time we left off, we had gotten the buggy hooked up and... <coughs> oh, excuse me, and charging away. So it's now able to charge and we can keep a charge in those batteries. And those two batteries will, if we are away from it, will last quite a while, so. Uh, I did some uh, uh, house cleaning, uh, house maintenance. I uh, emptied the buggy out and put that into the parts <clears throat> that I had into the large cargo container. I also did some mining. I uh, mined silicon and I mined some magnesium. Uh, and then I uh, was able to Mm, excuse me. I was able to load, uh, uh, get some of that stuff uh, refined, and I put that into the uh, carrier, our armored carrier. So, uh, if you look out, I hope we can still see it. Yeah, we can barely see it. You can kind of see where the base is, and there's another facility right on top of that hill. I think what we're going to have to do is go down and then we're going to have to do some uh, maintenance, or not maintenance, but scouting of that uh, base to see where we can get into it. Uh, I'm not sure that uh, we are going to just be able to do a full-on, just drive right on into the base like we have in some of these other places. So we'll get down uh, to our other little mini base down there. I also got the stuff to build a survival kit for down there, which will be good. And uh, let's grab a few more things here. Uh, I think we can get a little more silicon. And I already have grabbed some mag. We'll let this stuff just uh, uh, refine away. I got some raw stuff to take down to the other one. So let's uh, let's get going down to that other base. And let's see here. Let's get things turned on. Uh, I think that should be three. So let's... Uh, oh, uh, it's parked. So let's get off the rails here. And let's head down while we got some sunshine. Uh, yeah, we managed to come up straight up that hill right there in the buggy. So we missed our a uh, little bit smoother turn down here at the uh, by this uh, abandoned base. Now I don't think there was much in the way of stuff here but uh, we can always come back up and uh, I do see where it looks like might want to at some point consider building connecting that uh, windmill back up to it so that those batteries can start charging. Okay, hopefully we're not going to incite anything more. Hopefully we've already done that. That we're going to just be able to kind of head right down. Let's see if we can get down there without tearing something up too bad. There was that drone that was uh, there. There's one of the craters that was being blown up behind us. Uh, well, there's our... little base down here. Stay out of the crater. Pull in here. We'll 
back in. Probably be better. Yeah, I always... Ah. Oh, crap. Just park it. Alright. What do I need to do here? I need to turn that way, let's go. Back up just a little bit. Go forward a little bit. Back a little bit. Back. All right, let's get swung around here. Uh, straighten out a little bit more. And. Okay, let's park this. Okay, we will turn it off as soon as we get it unloaded. Let's see here. What do I have on me? Uh, a little bit of silicon. Let's go ahead and put that over here. And that way we have that on hand. Let's turn my light on so we can see. Uh, let's uh, actually let's do this. Grab that, that as much as we can. Once we get this medium emptied, then we can turn it off. Save our uranium. There, I'd get that refining. All right, where's our medium connect our connector? Oh, here's a cargo container. Grab that. All right, let's go ahead and turn battery block off that way there we go we're saving saving our uranium and I think the only way that we can get uranium is off those drones and maybe at the base They're, they might have some at the base so we can go ahead and put that there put that there go ahead and drop the magnesium in and the rest of the silicon so we'll be able to make stuff. So now the next thing I need to do is I want to put my survival kit in here. And so let's figure out where we want to put that at. And there comes the foul weather. I'm thinking in this room here, this is a passage. You know what it would be nice is to finish sealing this off. That's a window. Uh, we just need some bulletproof glass to finish that off. And then this will be airtight down here. That's half armor block. That's sealed. If we put a sliding door in here, well, we'd have to put an airlock, so I guess, actually, from the standpoint of oxygen, we don't need to worry about it, because it's high oxygen. So where do we want to put that survival kit? Where is a good place for it? Maybe, let's see here. How much space does it take? doesn't have to be connected into an O2 generator or anything. Uh, how, 
much space does it need? Uh, one block, it looks like. Alright, well let's go get the parts for it, and then we can kind of figure out where it's going to fit. Which we should have right here. Display, computers. Uh, we need that. We need that. Motors, and that can just stay right there. Okay. Another good place for it would actually be right here. And actually, you know what? That might make sense. We actually do have an O2 generator here. So, if we was to put that right there, I can get to the O2 generator from this side as well. You know what? I think right here is actually going to make more sense. So, let's put. Yeah, let's build it right here. So, we can get energy, there we go. All right. Well, of course the weather has come in. I would rather not, wow, yeah, we'll never be able to find that in this weather. I think we're gonna need to wait on the weather. Uh, so let's see. Uh, I know. Well, let's. You know what? Let's go finish harvesting the stuff right down here. Get this out of the way. There might have been a few more components left in here that we could get. Yeah. Let's just, uh... Oh yeah, these... A lot of stuff in there. I think at some point I am going to have to build me a flying machine. So this stuff, uh, <clears throat> all this stuff here will be good. And this is just going to bite our time while we uh, wait for this storm to pass. So we can put all of this stuff into here. We're starting to amass at least uh, some supplies. We know where there's cobalt. Uh, I have uh, silicon up above. Let's just clean this up. Since we don't have iron down here, Probably good that we can clean this stuff up. A lot of good steel plates. They're expensive. There's another motor. motor. Ah, three motors in there. That was, uh, actually that's a lot of good materials. I should say thrusters is what I should say. Alright. Bring those back up.
this off. Oh. All right. Okay. Well, it might be time to press our luck. So, I am thinking, I think we know what's going to happen on the front side. I think I want to come in through the back side. So let's see what happens here. Let's just see what happens. All right. Uh, let's uh, unpark this thing. Let's turn our batteries on. And I need to check something. I do have... So they're off. Uh, so that should turn... Does that turn that on? Okay, so that's on, off. Alright. So let's uh, do that. Alright. Okay. Let's see if the commander can get his butt in trouble again. I think we want to see if we can get up this slope here. I think this is the way I want to try to mount my attack. Let's get up here where we can see it. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. Let's just kind of st stop right here. Uh, let's actually do this. Let's see what we can see up here. I can't see any turrets. Something's going to start shooting at us, though, I'm pretty sure. There, there's the facility. It's a nice base. Okay, you know what? I need to. Uh, I need to go back down here and do something first. I think I don't want to take this in there yet. Uh, I think what I need to do is turn these off. And I need to do a GPS marker. Uh, new from current. Oh, 
armor. Vehicle. And so. So we could find our vehicle, at least at this point. Alright. So if I get shot up and die, I know where to go. So that looks like just an antenna. And it's not shooting at me, so... It, where is it shooting from? Yep. Okay. I think it's coming from over there. can't see me hunkered down here. Alright, we're going to back up. It's coming from that over there, I think, so let's uh, come down to this valley right here. Alright, we can stand up. Yeah, the old mining base doesn't seem to... Something's shooting at me. Okay. What was shooting at me? Oh, right there, I see it. Okay.
Dang it. I was shooting at the wrong spot. I'm getting it or not. All right, I might have gotten it there. Nope. But I took out whatever just zero in on it. Okay. I'm not sure, but I just took some more stuff out. Oh. I think that's an interior turret. Okay. I wonder. Let's kind of come around over here. Are we going to be able to get to it? Nothing else seems to be shooting at me. That's that corner right there. So we're going to go back and uh, get our vehicle. And we're going to come back in this back way. And hopefully we can get in close tight to it so that... Hmm. Where's our vehicle? Armored vehicle. Kidding. Oh. Oh, that was bad. 
I didn't realize I parked all the way over here for crying out loud. I don't know if we can get around with the vehicle. Oh wow. Okay. Okay. Let's unpark this guy. Oh, I need to turn things on. Let's get down into this valley. Can we do this? park this and figure out where in the hell we're at. That base is over that way. So if we're heading away from it. I think what I want to do is kind of get this over and positioned and then we'll make our attack onto the base. So if we can do that much. All right. Yep, I think this is okay. This is the way we want to go. Let's see if we can just kind of easily work our way over here, staying below the ridge line. Okay, I'm going to hop out here. Yep, there's our base. We want to come in from this angle. And if I can just motor up close to it in the, in the rig here, we'll be good. So I think with that, we are going to call this good for this video. Uh, we've made some progress. Or at least wise, we're, we're figuring out if we can do an assault. <coughs> Let me take a look at something. Okay, I still have ammo. That's good. This has ammo in it, so if I need to, I can get turn it on. But I'm trying not to have to shoot the base up too bad. So, uh, I think this is a good spot. So as always, please subscribe. It helps the channel out. And uh, please hit the thumbs up 
uh, on this uh, for the video that helps the video out and <clears throat> <coughs> and with that commander kingfish is out of here and I will see you all in the next video <laughs>